My first time ever at a school for teaching practice, I made an embarrassing mistake in front of the class. It was a common spelling error that they actually went over the week before. The whole class was surprised at my basic error. The teacher in charge saw, actually, my youngest brother was a student in that class, so even my family would know of my mistake. What should a teacher do if they make a mistake in class? I got this comment on a video. Eric, I made a horrible mistake in front of my class. They asked me a question and I gave the wrong answer. Even some of my colleagues found out about this and now they think I'm a bad teacher. What should I do? Teaching is an art that involves constant learning and adaptation. As educators, we strive to impart knowledge and inspire our students to reach their full potential. However, it is inevitable that mistakes will occur in the classroom, including those made in front of colleagues or when we don't have an immediate answer to a student's question. In this video, I will talk about how teachers can effectively handle mistakes turning them into valuable learning experiences while maintaining a supportive and growth oriented environment. Making mistakes in class. Embrace vulnerability. Teachers are role models and acknowledging mistakes demonstrates that everyone is prone to errors. Embrace vulnerability by openly discussing your mistake without becoming defensive or dismissive. Share how you plan to fix the situation, allowing students to see the importance of taking responsibility. If you make a factual error during a lesson, admit it and apologize. Explain the correct information, emphasizing the importance of double checking facts and the value of lifelong learning. Everyone can make a mistake. It's how we handle those mistakes that shows our students how to learn. Take responsibility. It is our job as teachers to prepare for our lessons. That means researching the topic and anticipating possible questions as well as difficulties our students might have when learning. Obviously, no one can know everything and there will be questions that stump even the best teacher. But that doesn't change the fact that it's our responsibility as professionals to be prepared for the topics we teach in class. Encourage critical thinking. Transform mistakes into teachable moments. Talk to your students about the mistake and encourage them to analyze the error, its causes and potential solutions. This fosters a growth mindset and develops their problem solving skills. If you make an error in solving a math problem on the board, ask students to identify the mistake and suggest alternative approaches. This promotes active learning and empowers the students to contribute to the classroom environment. Making mistakes in front of colleagues. Cultivate a supportive network. Establish a culture of collaboration and support among colleagues. Build relationships where constructive feedback is welcome, creating an environment that encourages growth and development. Emphasize that mistakes are valuable opportunities for professional growth. Don't become dismissive. We all learn from our mistakes. If you make a mistake during a team meeting or professional development session, embrace it as a chance for shared learning. Engage in open dialogue with colleagues, seeking their perspectives and input on how to improve. Remember to build rapport with your students and colleagues. If you make a mistake, you are less likely to feel judged by people you have a good relationship with. And if you can't be friends with your colleagues, you should at least be professional. That doesn't mean that they won't gossip behind your back, but at least your conscience will be clear that you maintained your integrity. Remember to reflect and refine. After making a mistake in front of colleagues, take time to reflect on what went wrong. Assess the factors that led to the mistake and develop strategies to avoid similar errors in the future. Share your reflections with colleagues, allowing for collective growth. How to answer a student's question when you don't know the answer. Be honest and transparent. Honesty is key when you don't have an immediate answer. Admit that you don't know the answer, but assure students that you will find the information and follow up with them. This demonstrates humility and reinforces the importance of seeking knowledge. If a student asks a question beyond your expertise, 
respond by saying, that's a great question. I don't have the exact answer right now, but let me look it up and I'll give you the answer in our next class. Encourage student involvement. Turn the situation into a collaborative learning experience. Ask students if they know the answer or if they could help research it. This fosters a sense of community and encourages peer-to-peer -peer learning. When a student asks a challenging question, say, I don't have the answer, but let's explore it together. Can anyone help us find information or offer insights? Ultimately, the journey of education is a continuous process of learning and adapting. By acknowledging and learning from our mistakes, we not only enhance our own professional development, but also set a powerful example for our students.